Would you like to create your very first link in the description or website totally for free? I'm going to show you how to do this with the actual Beacons application. Hello guys to this new video of the Talk Bros. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get started with Beacons.ai. So if you don't know what exactly is the Beacons, well the Beacons is a bird shadow platform that helps you create a custom LinkedIn value page totally for free. This is perfect for social media profiles and can help you having drive traffic to your various online presences from a single link. To get started, you have the link down below in the description, guys, so we can always start it totally for free. Now, once you have created your actual account, what we can do is to get started visiting the beacons.ai or the link that I'm going to leave down below, so we can start creating our very first element. Let's understand how to use the beacons. We can see that we have the setup link in bio, we have the create a digital product, send an email, build our website, create a media kit, and much more elements. We have the analytics of how many people check out our website, the track and take action here, the learn from expert advice and so more. Into the lab hub, we have the home, we have the LinkedIn bio, the website creation, email marketing, store, media kit, and referrals. Today, I'm going to focus only into LinkedIn bio. Inside LinkedIn bio, what you can do is to start creating your own link. As you can see, this is an actual site that we have just created. So if you want to start totally from scratch, what you can do, let's say for example, go for a new page. So here, this should be actually looking here at the header. So what I can do is to start by designing my page. Inside my page, for example, here, I have the header. So I click into my header and we have different layouts. So for example, here is the classic layout. This is the portrait. This is a banner rate. So choose the one that best suits for yourself. Scroll a little bit down and choose a profile picture. So I'm going to go for my downloads and I'm going to choose an actual image for this element. So as you can see here is an image. I can go and scroll a little bit down and try to look out for something much more easier to incentivize people to check out my website. So in this case, here it is. We go for accept. And we have a preview of how it's actually looking our profile image. So I scroll here, it says only media. Let's go for cool cats store. Now down here, the header gonna make this smaller. The social icons, you can add your own socials if you wanted to and the social icon, let's say for medium or smaller. Now into the appearance, you can choose a brand kit or create your own. In our case, I'm going to go for something related to what I'm actually going to choosing to get started in. So scroll a little bit down and have the solid, create an image and much more. Now in here, what you can do is to customize your page as you are adding much more elements. For example, the square, the round, block styles, and so much more. If you kind of like what you're seeing in here, then what you can do is to add an actual product. In adding a product, let's go for select a product, and there's no product add here. So to add a specific product, of course, what you can do is to create one. But first of all, make sure that you have to link it in, uh, create it first of all. So I'm gonna go into the upper side, and into my design, let's go into my pages. We have created our very first header. Now into my header, I'm gonna add in a specific store, so I can enable my store, I select it, and here I can start adding my uh, elements here. So for example, I connect it directly with my Shopify store. So I go for connect and here is my store name. Into the upper side, you usually have the settings and into my settings, let's go and focus into domains. You want to copy this domain and paste it directly into your actual Shopify. And your product should be added automatically. Now, to make sure that your product doesn't look that bad, we can go directly into my link in bio once again, and we can add different links. So we can add the referral links, for example, let's say uh, I'm gonna add one link, and let's say I can add a product from Amazon, and I go for add. So under the title, let's say for example, get, and I can choose an image to, of course, upload, make sure it actually looks, what I'm actually focusing on, for example, is Amazon. So as you can see, we have get 10% discount and here's the image of the Amazon. So when somebody clicked in here, it's gonna be sending us directly here into Amazon. So once you've finished uh, editing all the tools, you can get started in. Let's go back here and I'm gonna delete the text. I wanted to see it and let's go for share. This is my selected domain, but I can choose to share to everybody. So I'm gonna copy and paste my beacons linked. And this is what everybody should be looking at. So if I clicked into one of those, I wanted to make sure that this link sent them directly into where I'm actually sending them. For example, in my case, this should be Amazon. So once you fill all of the information, you're actually good to go. Now into the right part, you have the design where you can customize more stuff. 
and the insights. The insights can be telling you how many people check out your website, uh, into when traffic from other Instagram account and so much more. So when somebody click, for example, let's say from Facebook, the Facebook go directly into a sneaker, for example. So this is how we can actually get started using the beacons section. You have the different views, the clicks, the CTR. We can have the more transaction analytics, more transactions email, and that will be actually it, guys. So uh, with that being said, guys, you can watch it at the very end of the video. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more amazing tools how you can actually use beacons. This is an actual great application to get started in adding your LinkedIn bio. You can create much more elements, for example, adding affiliation products. You can, of course, get started in creating an actual digital product, create an actual website, creating email digital marketing, and so much more elements uh, here in the beacons. So once again, guys, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. You have the link down below in the description to have a huge deal directly here in the beacons so you can get started totally for free and having a great membership. So thank you once again for watching the video, guys. Hopefully, we can all see you next time.